<clears throat> what's going on it's uh the final setup of my previa um i went with the previa because it doesn't stand out as much <clears throat> anyways you see my how it was previous and then uh one of the videos i've seen on youtube uh this lady she always talked about cleanliness and organization which i think everybody is promoting actually uh, when you do this type of thing keep it clean it only make your life easier and so compared to my previous video um actually i gotta i'm vacuuming my van tonight i try to do it once a week or if it gets really messy i try not to but um so again here's my cot um usually i had my before i had my closet hanging up there but it actually fits perfectly under my bed and so that's where it goes yoga mats um the cooler um it actually fits pretty good too and one of the things uh, I didn't like was that when I had it right here on the side and if I was driving it would shift so when I put it underneath there at least it doesn't shift as much it's uh, always in place so um, at night time I take it out and it becomes like a, like a side table I put my, my keys and my phone on there plus when I lay in the cot uh, my back isn't resting on it and so here is my uh, rack with the um, car storage or uh, car uh, clo uh, clothing rack um, like I said I was I did one of these but as you can see I also put um, PVC pipe I didn't want to waste all the PVC pipe that I had but unfortunately you can see this is the issue before too is that all that pressure of pulling it makes it warp and you know, I have my screen sticks here. I have a couple things here. Not not anything too heavy, um, but it's still enough to... And then I try to stretch it out, so I think it's all that pressure of stretching it out and trying to make it tight, um, causing it to to be like this and, and warp. Um, as I said before, there's my Reflectix on all the windows and even the back. Um, on top of... It being tinted factory and then tinted with 5% um, on on the other side of these Reflectix is also uh, black cloth which I stapled um, just to definitely give that privacy um, black curtain between the drivers uh, the front cabin and the rest of the van I always like to s sneak through here at the end of the night after I park Make sure no one's looking, but I always got to be careful because I'll sn snag right here. Uh, what else? Um, the front, I always try to keep empty. Make sure that no one, nothing. I take my radio deface off. Make sure that it doesn't look exciting. Um, come back here. Here are some, here's my tools underneath on the other side. Um, uh, for emergencies, uh. And whatnot, and then <clears throat> all my hygiene stuff in here to keep, to keep close by. Um, I realize that the shoe rack hasn't really played a major role, but um, I'm gonna keep it around for just a little bit more because I do see the storage uh, abilities with it or capabilities I can use it for and try to be more distinct. So I might take out a couple pairs of shoes and be able to hang stuff on there um of course my laundry as everyone says try to i try to do it once a week um or i do laundry once a week and so i'm gonna go vacuum but also you know behind each um seat besides the normal pocket i have these one on the other side as well and uh that is pretty much it um gym bag school bag yeah yoga mat for doing yoga but that's uh pretty much it and uh as people say keep it simple keep it minimalistic and i've been trying to do that and every week i've been finding stuff like yeah i don't need this i don't need that and so that's what i'm doing this week anyways that's what it is later